Hello and welcome to my NTC Reviews channel. Today I want to briefly go over my progress with my Helium 5G outdoor hotspot. If you're not familiar with the Helium hotspot, basically by me having this apparatus uh, configured in my home, I am able to provide coverage for the Helium network. And in return, I earn cryptocurrency tokens in the form of mobile tokens by providing that coverage. It's been roughly about six weeks now since I've had the hotspot up and running and things are progressing uh, pretty well. I'm averaging about a thousand mobile tokens a day, a little bit more than that. But if things continue to progress the way that they've been progressing over the last six weeks, I'll definitely be happy with my return on investment. And barring that I haven't actually provided coverage yet, but have been receiving these rewards just by being active and live on the network, I'm hoping that better things are yet to come as the Helium network grows. If you're not a technical person and worried that if you do pick up uh, one of these Helium uh, hotspots, you won't be able to configure it or let me just say that you could put your fear aside because the setup process on this outdoor hotspot is extremely simple as far as configuration now when it comes to mounting it and getting as high as you can on a roof and choosing different mounts it might get a little bit more complicated but i do feel that it's something that most people can certainly handle on their own in worst case with the help of a friend or two that don't mind going up on ladders everything is configured via the mobile builders app it'll just walk you through the whole process fairly simple especially as compared to the other CBRS radios that came out initially that required a bit more technical knowledge when it came to the setup process. Everything that I needed was pretty much in the box since I was already on the Helium network as far as with my IoT devices and other IoT hotspots and miners over the last few years, I was able to use the same Helium wallet and be able to configure that in order to receive the mobile rewards that I was earning now through this 5G outdoor hotspot. I did receive my hotspot from Minted, which is part of Rack Wireless. I've been dealing with that company for about four years now, and compared to other customer support and other companies that I've dealt with, I highly recommend Minted and Rack Wireless. And the main reason for that, considering that all other things as far as hardware uh, is relatively equal as far as specs, the things that stands out the most with Minted and with Rack Wireless is their customer support. Every time that I have an issue, I send in an email and I get that response and not just a regular response that's a, a stall type response that I've received from many other companies when I contact their tech support. They actually work with you, provide the solution and provide it as fast as possible. And let's face it, the more information that I have, the quicker that the customer support gets back to me, the more mobile tokens and cryptocurrency that I'm able to earn. Being part of the people's network and contributing to that is a pretty cool thing, but earning cryptocurrency tokens is an even cooler thing, at least for me. As I've mentioned, it's been about six weeks now of earning the mobile tokens. And you can see here that there's the detailed graph on the Explorer, basically showing my earnings uh, day by day. Uh, there were a few times that I had some outages with my actual internet. So there were days where I couldn't earn any rewards. There were other days where I earned less rewards. But once again, that had nothing to do with the actual Helium network. That had to do with my Wi-Fi provider. So always being on top of this Explorer and seeing that your speed tests are being done and they're accurate and up to par is a good preemptive way to make sure that you're continually earning and maximizing your mobile rewards. As I alluded to earlier, I still haven't provided any mobile coverage as far as somebody actually using their mobile phone on the Helium network. I myself, my contract is uh, ending, about to end in the next month or so, and I definitely want to jump on the uh, Helium network as far as being an end user and using that as my main mobile phone service. And I'm excited to see how that works out, especially since I know that I have great coverage in my own home. There shouldn't be any issues at all. And the other cool factor is not only is it much less expensive than my current provider, but I'll actually be earning extra cryptocurrency by utilizing my cell phone in my home. If you wanna see the results on how that goes, be sure to subscribe to my channel. And of course, I'll be making some updated videos on that progress once I do switch over to Helium Network for my cell phone service. As of late, Helium's been doing some great things. Uh, their hips are uh, getting approved 
and other carriers are being added to the network so it's just growing and growing and growing and they've been doing this under the radar at least for most people that aren't involved or uh, as intimately as we are with the helium network so i certainly feel that there are a lot of uh, let's say pleasant surprises coming in the very near future once again this isn't financial advice it's just my opinion so if i piqued your curiosity and you decide that you would like to uh, pick one of these outdoor wi-fi helium hotspots up in order to shore up the helium network and earn some cryptocurrency in the process i will place my affiliate link in the description as well as in the comments field and if you do utilize it i certainly appreciate your support i plan on adding more updates not only for this specific uh, outdoor hotspot but also other devices that i plan on adding in the very near future that also work on the helium network so if you're interested in that information subscribe and stay tuned